Hey there, folks. Uh, this is Matt once again. And uh, if I sound kind of weird, it's because uh, um, last week's been kicking my ass. Um, um, I had some reviews saved so I could upload stuff because you never know what happens. Um, I even have two other reviews I upload maybe in a few days but I record them a while ago because since last Tuesday or Wednesday for some reason my eyes kept tearing up again and again and again like just constantly tearing to the point I could barely see my eyes were blurring um, it just no matter what I did I took allergy medicine, that didn't work. I took other medicine, that didn't work. Then, uh, I was going to call a doctor, but I wanted to see if the medicine worked. And then, like, Thursday, Friday night, no, Thursday night, I went to bed, and literally one eye, like, crusted all over. For It felt like something was in my eye, scratching my eye. I couldn't sleep at all. I kept doing whatever, not rubbing them, but like trying to see. There, it felt like there's something in it, so trying to blink it out didn't work. My left eye like crusted all over, so by morning I couldn't even open it, so I didn't get any sleep that day. And Friday I waited till eight in the morning to call. They said, "Well, the only time we got is eight forty a.m., so that was like twenty minutes or so." to walk two fucking miles and um, I tried to run that didn't help I gave up like a mile in I'm like I got like five minutes to walk a mile <laughs> that ain't happening so here it is like it was Friday at 9 a.m. and the earliest they can get is fucking 2 a.m. on Tuesday no 2 p.m. on Tuesday I'm like, nowhere at all today or tomorrow, and you're not open Sunday or Monday. Fuck Labor Day. Fuck it. So I took some NyQuil, and it knocked my ass out, because I slept for about 12 hours, and I'm still tired. I'll see how I am at on Tuesday, if somehow I miraculously get better. And I'm not trying to sound this way, like, oh, I'm going to talk. I just, this is how I, I'm sounding now. So I'm sure people think I'm drawn, but it's NyQuil. But, uh, so if you're not seeing new videos for a little bit, or if you see videos, they're videos I have made before and saved. So, uh, just let, let people know. I don't know how long it'll be. Uh, basically, I've just been watching the show that I picked up for ten bucks. Really like this show. It only lasts for two seasons. Apparently, it got canceled because of cost issues. But I think that's bullshit. For what I heard, the the Sci-Fi Channel lady who owns the Sci-Fi Channel now, or whatever, is a bitch. Who didn't like the show for some fucking reason. So that's why. There's not even a season 2. The last season of this. This shit lasted more than 2 seasons. Bullshit. Uh, I'm gonna let you go fuck yourself up or cunt. Don't give a fuck if I'm PC and pissed. I'm not calling her a country. She's a lady. I'm calling her a country. She's a cunt. Uh... <laughs> basically uh, what's coming up next is uh, I wanted to do some more uh, I wanted to revisit three Dolph Lundgren films I recorded two before all this happened uh, The Punisher and Showdown Low Tokyo and I want to uh, Men of War <clears throat> that'll be another day uh, I'm not doing requests so just so you know, I'm not doing requests. I just want to keep it easy and do my own thing. I'm sorry, I'm not doing requests. 
Um, I did make a wish list on Amazon because uh, I know my friend Michael Keane has a wish list on Amazon. So I'm just going to put it down below um, my wish list on Amazon. So that way, if anyone's rich and famous out there, they can buy me something. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just being silly. Uh, I don't know why. Just because, like, it's like fuck, dude. Why not? Um, because I'm greedy. Uh, I'm just being silly. Because you have to be silly, otherwise you're uh, shit out of luck. But I know there's other people worse out out there, so ooh, poor me. Yeah, I know. <clears throat> I'm basically seeing if there's any news that's worth a shit. Probably not. Um, if you wonder why I'm sort of looking at my bottom lip, I fucking bit it on accident while eating something. Um. Shit, I thought there was something, but I fucking forgot what it was. The piece of news. Yeah, I fucking forgot what it was. Oh, yeah. The Robocop remake. Michael Keaton is now going to be the bad guy, not Hugh Laurie. Yay. Give Michael Keaton an actual good movie, maybe. He's made good movies. I mean, let him star in a fucking movie nowadays, for fuck's sake. I would make, my routine's made a lot of good movies. I just mean, like, lately. Well, I liked him and the other guys, but still, like, give him a star and roll in something. Not just a bad guy in a shitty remake. But either way, I guess it's basically just me talking about what's coming next. Uh, those two Dolph Lundgren ones, and then I want to do one more. I know I've reviewed Dolph Lundgren films in the past, but. Just wanted to uh, let people know about them again because I think those are some underrated action movies. Uh, if you haven't seen them, check out Showdown Low Tokyo, The Punisher, and Men of War, which I'll be doing reviews for. Well, I've done reviews for two of them. One will be. Uh, I want to review The Raid Redemption sometime. Uh... And then uh, after that, I'll probably review just action movies in September. Random action movies that I want to review. Uh, and then October, doing horror stuff. Um, again, I'm not taking requests, but in October, maybe I'll do like a, a director. Maybe I'll do like Wes Craven or Toby Hooper or something like that. Because when I first started this account, I did all of John Carpenter's films, except The Ward, because The Ward sucked, in my opinion. I thought it was a shitty film with a shitty ending. But that's just my opinion. But I reviewed all the other John Carpenter's films that are on the account. The State from L.A., all those stuff is reviewed. So who knows, maybe I'll do Wes Craven, maybe I'll do Toby Hooper. Film franchises, I don't want to do Leprechaun. I don't want to do Children of the Corn. I don't want to do fucking Candyman or something like that. But either way, um, something will come up. But yeah, September I'll be doing action films. And, uh, oh yeah, I have my Amazon wish list, just in case for anybody. Um,. And, uh, I just mainly just, uh, sorry, uh, I don't know what this vlog is for, actually. <laughs> I guess I just wanted to record something, but I guess I was just bored. But either way, thanks for watching, and we will see you next time you'll see, since I recorded before, a much perkier version, and... It'll be The Punisher and Showdown Low Tokyo. So, stay tuned. Look at my wish list. Buy me something. Make me feel better. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just having fun. It's just, it's just that you see a lot of these 
not a lot of these guys, but you see like, like big guys, it's like, they do like commercials, like buy t-shirts and shit, and it's like, I don't know, it just, it's kind of funny to me, it's like, it's YouTube, <laughs> you know, people got the money for you, they don't use it for their bills and food, not to buy somebody they don't know stuff, it just, the, the way I can understand it, if it's for a friend, you know, like, hey, I'm buying it for its friend, it's just, it's weird that you have some people like, I don't even know you do, why should I give you money? <laughs> That was just sort of a weird thing. So, so that's why I try to be tongue in cheek with it. Um, but either way, in all seriousness, I want to thank you guys for still watching. Um, thank you guys for still listening. And I'll probably call this a punch drunk vlog because I, I, even now I sound like I'm drunk. And I'm not drunk, but I must be on NyQuil or something because I'm talking like it. And I'm saying, like, shit that doesn't even make sense to me. Just, it made sense before it erupted out of my mouth, but now it doesn't. So, I'm going to get some more rest, and I'll see you later. <laughs> Ciao.